Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Tyler, and this is Scorpio Oxman Channel. And happy Saturday to you, October 17, 2020. And uh, so I'm. I'm actually. Uh, this was a video request that I'm doing. That I'm. That I'm doing for you guys today, for all my subscribers and viewers, and uh, and fans. Uh, so one of my subscribers, uh, Selena Shepherd. Uh, she's she's asked me the question. Could you do a video on pig and rat compatibility? And that's referring to the Chinese astrology. So yes, absolutely, Selena. Uh, thanks so much for your video request. And uh, so yeah, I I definitely noticed. Uh, I've noticed a lot of um, pigs do get along with rats. And something I find interesting as well is um, the rat. The rat is the first sign of the Chinese zodiac, the first of the 12 animal signs. And the pig is the last one, the 12th and, and final animal. So that's, that's interesting how that works out. What I know is uh, the, rat, the rat and the pig, what's very interesting, and this is probably the biggest reason why I think they get along, because both of them are the water signs of the Chinese. The rat is a water sign and the pig is a water sign. The rat is made of yang water, okay? The pig is made of yin water. There's yang and yin or yin and yang. So that's the yin and yang right there. So, and you know, the other, the other animals of the Chinese zodiac, there's the wood signs, which are the, basically the tiger and rabbit. There's the fire signs, which are the snake and horse. And the metal signs are the rooster and monkey. And there's actually uh, uh, four, there's, there's the four earth signs, which are the, the sheep, the ox are made of yin earth, and the dragon and dog are made of yang earth. So, but the, the rat and the pig, they're the water signs. Okay, so I think that's uh, quite most likely the biggest reason why they're compatible and they get along really well. Um, generally, the rat, it is the rat that's attracted to the pig, okay? Because members of the first trine are attracted automatically to members of the fourth trine, okay? So in the Chinese zodiac, the uh, there's four trines. Each of the trines have three members. Okay, so that's 12 in all, 12 animals in all. So the rat is a member of the first trine and the pig is a member of the fourth trine. So I'll, I'll say once again, or repeat it once again. Members of the first trine, they are attracted to members of the fourth trine. So this is why the rat is attracted to the pig to begin with. And I believe they get along in general because because um, they're both the water signs, yin and yang with water. And another thing too, um, and this is kind of a joke, but I think this could be true because you see the pig came last. The pig uh, lost the race. They came dead last. So the pig probably felt a little a little down and blue, and probably you know may maybe cried a little bit. So, but the rat was the winner. The rat came along. The rat came along and probably gave the pig a, a little hug to cheer him up and say, "Hey, look, you don't want to be at the." So the rat probably said to the pig, "Hey, you you don't want to be at the top. Trust me, it's lonely out there. You know, I'm number one. I won the race. I'm number one. But let me tell you, it's lonely up there. Don't feel bad. Don't feel bad. You know, you don't you don't want to be at the top, man. It's it's pretty bad up there. So." And that, that's probably how the rat and the pig became friends. And, you know, because the rat was the winner of the race and the pig was last. And, but in general, they're the water sign. So, but I, I kind of thought of that and say, you know, that could be a possibility as well. You know, the rat felt bad for the pig and, you know, just, just wanted to give him a little comfort in that and say, hey, cheer up. It's not a big deal. You don't want to be at the top anyway. It's lonely up there. So... Uh, but anyhow, and yeah, that's in the story of the, that's regarding the story of the Buddha who called upon all the animals of the earth for a great race, to have the great race. And, and that's when all of them were lined up from first to last in the race. 
So, uh, so anyhow, I'm going to show you some websites today as well. Uh, these are amazing websites that, that I found regard, that shows uh, info on the compatibility between the, the pig and rat. And I'm going to leave you for the links of them below that you could visit any time and read as well. Okay, so uh, we'll go on. I'll, I'll get them up right now. Okay. So this is, these are the pictures I found on Google, Google Images. And these are adorable pictures here with the pig and rat that I ju just wanted to show you. And uh, as you can see, they're, again, they're the pig and rat, they're the water signs. So I think in general, they would get along. And okay, so this one right here, this website is called Your Chinese Astro Your, sorry, yourchineseastrology.com. Okay, so this is a good one here that shows about the compatibility. So in this case, it's the male pig with female rat. You are a wonderful pair. Uh, you are a good match. Both of you are kind, easygoing, capable, and full of vigor. You always keep a positive attitude and clear, clear ideas towards life, and you will never give up uh, your principles or follow the current. Uh, the male pig is, is simple, kind-hearted, and pays attention to obtaining material benefits and ac accumulating wealth. And the female radish uh, can be shrewd, clever, and capable of offering workable strategies for her husband. Okay, so I'm just gonna go, I'm actually just gonna go to, uh, cause I, I, know, I know you'd like to see a female pig with male rat. So, so we'll, swip, we'll, we'll, uh, we'll swap the genders in this case. <laughs> so female pig and male rat. Okay ability and that's so it's down here here it is right here okay your chinese astrology.com it gives very good detail very great detail on the uh, the description of the compatibility of the relationship so here is male rat and female pig okay so this is the opposite genders a lively pair you are a couple that can share each other's pleasure, anger, sorrow, and joy. Both of you are deeply immersed in the warm and harmonious family. You are attracted to each other both in soul and body. The male rat lacks, could lack a steady disposition and he often can't well control the process of enough calmness with enough calmness. The female pig, on the other hand, is satisfied with the spiritual life and can and can bring much luck in making money uh, to the relationship. Okay, so I'm gonna show you one of my favorite sites. This, so this site right here, dressking.com, I've been reading this site for almost 25 years. Over 20 years I've been reading, I've been, it's one of the older sites. I think it's one of the oldest websites on the internet of, of astrology, and it shows amazing detail. Um, uh, um, it gives like kind of short descriptions of the compatibility of the relationship compatibility, but it's like right to the point. It really gets right to the point of what it's like in regarding the Chinese astrology. So again, I'm going to leave this link for you uh, below to explore it as well. And it's just, it's just a very, it's just a very interesting read. And I, I've, again, I've read, I've been visiting and reading this website, this website, I've gotten most of the info I know uh, as an astrologer was from this website. And so and I've been seeing it, I've been uh, reading it for over 20 years. So, okay, so here is uh, the rat and the pig right here. So we'll select it. Okay, so it gives the rat man and the pig woman. Okay, so it gives uh, both, gen both uh, opposite genders of them. Rat man and pig woman. This is a good relationship. They are gamblers and intellects at the same time. Both of them can be very happy. So that's the that's the description. So that's very good between between the male rat and the female pig. Okay, so now the male pig and rat woman. This is a happy marriage as long as the rat is not abusive. Uh, we cannot be abusive to pigs, or a pig should not be abused to. 
So that's what it says. So you know, it's it's pretty well it's pretty well gets an A in my opinion. And again, they're both the water signs, and uh, that's that's a definite a definite evidence of uh, why they make a very good pair, the rat and the pig. So thanks again for your uh, for your question and your video request, uh, Selena. I greatly appreciate it. I want to thank all my subscribers again and all your support, guys. I greatly appreciate it. Thanks so much. And uh, uh, thanks again and have a great weekend, guys. And by the way, I want to wish a very happy Halloween season to everyone out there as well. So thanks again, guys. All the best and God bless. Thank you.